Supervised and owned by Derek Beery, Vice Grip Garage is one of the best channels in the auto body niche. This video is dedicated to Vice Grip Garage. The motive of the channel is very simple. It makes content related to cars, budget builds, resumes, and regular how-tos for the common folks out there and who like taking things under their own hands. Derek has spent most of his time in Minneapolis with his family. Mainly, he mainly focuses on automobiles, but his personality adds a tinge of warmth to his vlogs with his son sometimes accompanying him on his expeditions. Derek is a good man and a patriot. He has an amazing character and a video packed with light humor and a lot of words from the wise. They were based in Minneapolis with their business scattered across Minnesota and Wisconsin. Derek isn't a certified mechanic, but he has skills passed down from his father and grandfather as they fixed cars back when they lived in Mino in North Dakota. He has been fixing cars for over two decades now. This further concretes how knowledge this further concrete how knowledge from experience is much more beneficial than theoretical academic knowledge. Well, don't get me wrong, pairing it together is even more of a better bargain when it comes to knowledge. His dream car is a Buick Special 2-door hardtop. He embarks on fun expeditions and the element of surprise always adds a lot of touch to his content like how he founded a 1969 AMC Rebel in a junkyard that had to be driven with him sitting in the back seat. While driving midway through the journey, the engine leaked and so he had to stop and ask for a ram truck to take it back to his lab and fix it in his garage. He also found a 1972 Chevelle which was cast away in a junkyard which he later dubbed Independence because of the color combination it had. He knew he had a patriotic responsibility to revive it back and so he did. After it was restored to glory, the car was later showcased at several events in Indianapolis and Florida. They've been living in Minneapolis for a long time, but they moved to Tennessee, and Derek being the man he is with Jessica, explained how they exactly made that decision. Derek is a family man and is very particular about his fans. The first reason was savings and being a family man is some of the main concerns anyone has. Living in Tennessee is much cheaper than in Minnesota. Tennessee seems much more lucrative for the creator as the setting is favorable. The location is strategically great and now that he has made the change, he does not need to block an entire week just to attend a one-day event. Time is precious and no one wants to miss a good family weekend now, do we? Anyway, traveling for Derek is one of the main money drainers from the gas. He also has to make stops at places that lead to hotel payments, food and lodging, and the same goes for parts as well. He would have to commute for hours just to get some items from shops around the area, and this made the production of the video lengthy and now that he's living in a good location, everything is smooth. But the main reason why they made the shift was because of the weather. The frigid zone and the climate conditions made it harder for him to work. Being a full-time creator and a people pleaser, he wants to make sure that his fans are happy, but holding a spanner in cold is tough and Tennessee is known for good weather. Jessica also added that it was also for the kids. Well, Minnesota is a beautiful place to raise kids. The neighborhood was restricting their kids by calling the police even when they were just playing with their snowmobiles on their property. That does not happen in Tennessee. Derek is delighted that he could reach this percentage of success and that's all because of his viewers as a closing statement, he said. Our goal is, always put a smile on you folks' faces, entertain you, where you can sit down with your family or your kids and just enjoy some stuff and hopefully we get you motivated and get you out to the shop and garage. So we just decided, you know, we needed to find better weather where we could do what we do best and have fun doing it. He's one of the best guys in the niche, I'm sure that even if he only makes family vlogs, his calm conduct will most certainly make all of his videos pleasant and engaging. Vice Group Garage has a net worth of more than $1.7 million and earns nearly 870 k yearly. The channel presently has 1.3 million subscribers with just 274 videos. Pretty awesome. That's gonna do it guys, thank you so much for watching, subscribe for more updates, and we'll see you next time.